Hi there, this is Abhishek and welcome to ClickView Tutorials where I share ClickView related videos and in today's video I will going to talk about how you can use the ClickView advanced search dialog box for doing the advanced search in your ClickView dashboard. But before I move ahead with the main topic, let me give you a quick information about the art programming videos which I have started making from past couple of months. And if you want to learn art programming, you can go visit my art video tutorials channel and subscribe to it to get the videos directly in your inbox. Similarly, if you want to get these videos, click view related videos in your inbox, you can subscribe to it. All right, let's move on to the main subject. And the idea is that you have filters, you have charts and you want to filter, let's say region by uh, those values, let's say sum of sales by product category where sales is let's say more than 5 million or 500,000 whatever may be the value so generally for doing that what you can do you can click on the search put equals to and say sum of sales and greater than let's say 500,000 as you can see rest of the values are removed but only those values which are greater than 5,000 in that particular region are being uh, shown to you and if I put another zero all the values will be gone so apart from this if I put six or seven or eight or nine accordingly you know the idea is simple that it will show only values where the sum of sales is greater than nine uh, nine hundred thousand so how you can write much more complex where you probably can say sum of sales is nine thousand nine hundred thousand order quantity is more than a hundred thousand and stuff like this so generally Management is really interested in knowing about such figures, which is more of like a data mining. You go and mine and mine data more based on the how you are doing the business. And then uh, there should be some interface where you can write such expression and give the filtered value back to the uh, back in the dashboard for the management. All right. So for that, what you can do is you can select region, go into the edit and click on advanced search. And here, uh, what we can do is we can select the field on which we want to apply the filter as it is mentioned search in and region is what we have by default selected. But you have a couple of other fields based on what you have in your dashboard. But I will just go ahead and use the region itself uh, for this example. And I would say sum of sales, let's say greater than 500,000 so just for the basics 500,000 I will say go and it will select only those values where in the region where value is greater than 500,000 all right uh, what next we can do is and so and is basically to increase more complexity and ordered quantity let's say ordered quantity but we need to use the expression which is sum sum of order quantity is greater than let's say 20,000 and we are saying go now the value is further reduced similarly if we have any other expression or uh, any other requirement or understanding from the management about how they want to see the data we can keep and adding the values to here maybe like shipping cost shipping cost is greater than let's say five hundred thousand dollar but you need to use the sum or average or whatever is the aggregation function and say go so probably in enti all the cases it is 5000 maybe i can change it to let's say 15000 go now atlantic is removed so the idea is that uh, you get all of these values uh, or flexibility where you can specify all the expression for that particular region and keep the uh, keep selected only those values where management has interest and probably once it is done uh, what I usually do is I copy this if I need to modify this expression later because generally it does not show or if I go back into the advanced search it will not show me so what I'll do is I copy it open the notepad and paste it go back and if I just say go and close this and go back again into edit advanced search it will not show me that particular uh, uh, expression so that's why i saved it but suppose i have not saved it and still i want to see it i can do it with the help of uh, 
um, select object. So let me search where it is, current selections box and click OK. And here is my expression, which I have written over here, which is sum of sales is greater than this, sum of order quantity is this, and sum of uh, shipping cost is this. So that's another way I can uh, basically go in and uh, do the advanced search. So that's the basic idea I wanted to tell in this video. And uh, before I uh, end the video, I will just share one more thing that you can use the bookmark. As you will be aware about the bookmark, that you can bookmark this particular analysis with the with any particular name. Let's say um, regions where sale is more than five hundred thousand. Maybe that's the name I want to give. And let's say if I clear everything, and I want to select that bookmark, that entire piece will be selected for me so that I can have different bookmarks which based on these expression and current selection will show me the expression where bookmark will save all that expressions for me. So that's pretty much all I wanted to talk in this video about how you can use the advanced search dialog and then use current selection and bookmark to further advance your dashboard.